Uh, what they're smoking is producing the long chronic irritation of the upper respiratory tract. And that leads to the chronic irritation into the oral mucosa, in the floor of mouth, tongue, as well as the pharynx, and down below into the bronchial trees, into the lungs. This chronic irritation may change into keratosis and malignancy later on. For avoiding smoking is the best preventive measure and can be done to keep the smoking cigarette shop away from the educational area like the schools, like universities, colleges and offices. They should not be allowed to be smoked in the offices, offices, hospitals and, uh, and public places. If you do this thing, follow this thing, then about 40% of their reaction is the lung cancer. The lung cancer not only occurs to the person who is a smoker, but can occur to other persons who are passive smokers, who are in the company of the smokers. So they inhale the fumes, which also accelerate and can lead to the lung cancer. Lung cancer otherwise also a pollution in the area. The high carbon or sulfide in the content of the air can also lead to the increase in the reaction of the lung and leading to the cancer formation. In India, the tobacco is one of the most common of cancer of the oral tissue and upper and lower cancer infection. This also leads to cancer of the mouth, oral tissue, as well as lungs and larynx. So, avoiding this, avoid smoking will lead to the check in the reduction or reduction in the number of cases all over the world. And I think it should be a dear thing.